Hi guys. So today I'm gonna sh it's gonna be a quick video just to show you how to actually add real players to the game. Um, I'm just gonna use one example, Tyson Fury. So um, let's get into it. So obviously you go to editor. You choose the default database. If you already had have been editing, you can obviously use um, your database that you want to continue from. But we do default. Um, obviously, to to edit gems is quite easy. You can just click on any gem here and just um, well edit name, starting balance, nationality, manager stuff, um, your trainer, and your roster, and then. Um, gym level so for now for this video we'll be focusing on the roster so we said the uh, Tyson Fury so he is from uh, England so let's let's put him in the English gym and he's also from Manchester so let's take um, let's um, edit this guy so for, it's quite easy you just click on him and you just say he's for name which is his so we say, oh my goodness, Tyson, Fury, changes weight class to, well, he's a heavyweight, nationality is correct, um, he's, I think he's 33 years old, just make sure I have, have a Wiki, uh, Wikipedia page open here, so let's just quickly have a look, so he is, yeah, 33, Stance is the guy. Uh, what else do I have? 206 and uh, that is 206. Where is this? Where, oh, it just gives that. Okay. So this is 206. We don't have his weight. It just says he's a heavy weight. It just says he's a heavyweight. Okay, but then you just put in his weight here. Um, this is obviously going to be incorrect um, because it's the other guys, but uh, you can just get your like um, players weight here. Obviously, then his potential. So he's quite old, so I don't think he has a lot of potential left. So let's go for 10. And then this, this is important to have his actual photo. So what you do now is you download whatever picture you want of this guy. Um, so I already downloaded the photo. Then uh, let's go. So I have this photo of him. So what we need to do is this photo needs to be let's edit it quickly. It needs to be 270 by 270. Okay, and it needs to be a PNG file. So we save. Now our um, photo has been saved. Then we go to where you we go to where your game is actually installed. So mine is on my C drive. Program files. Steam, uh, Steam apps, common, boxing club manager, external, and photos. Yeah. Okay. So now what we do is we can see the last one here is 66. So we can add 67. So let's say we're going to use fighter 67. Let's go to the game. It's for photo ID is 67. Okay. Let me just go back here. Grab that photo. 67. We copy. Quick paste this here. Here we go. It's our photo. Back to the game. Right then, obviously. You can also change some attributes, so you know you can do here what you want. Change some attributes as you feel. You can also easier to maybe click here. You can say nine to nine. So if you 
You can do this, you know, you can just play around here, you can autogen. So let's say it's a 9 autogen, so you can do, or say, 5. So you can you can play around here. Then after that, all you do is, uh, you say, save. Now you see it's saved. This editor slot now has data in it. So let's see if we do this. There we have Tyson Fury in um in the game. Just check that reach. Uh, where is that now? Oh, we can't edit the reach. Just the weight is obviously incorrect, but uh, you can just change that data. So now we finish. It would so every time it would say this. So just make sure before you exit that you actually did say save changes in selected slot and then you can just finish it so now let's say new game we choose our new database go to england uh, manchester and there we go tyson fury So if you have any questions, um, drop a comment down below. And if you like the video, please um, subscribe. See you next time, guys.